What's up, guys? Eric, I'm in the studio with the new Arma Outcast 8S EXB. I'm going to be uh, testing out some new uh, bashing packs from Gen's Ace. Uh, first of all, huge thank you from Gen's Ace for sending these out to try. Uh, these are 6800 milliamp 120C packs. They should uh, definitely pack some punch and have some decent runtime being 6800 milliamp. They do come with uh, uh, EC5 or IC5 compatible plugins. Personally, I don't like running anything over uh, 7000 in a, in a truck like this uh, simply for the weight. So a 6800 milliamp would be just about perfect in a truck like this. This truck is still running the stock chassis. It's got some scrapes on it. It's a little bit of wear. Uh, but overall, I mean, for what this truck has been through in the past videos, uh, if you guys haven't seen them, check them out. Uh, I'm just uh, simply amazed this chassis is held together as, uh, as good as it has. I mean, being a short wheelbase, it's not going to bend as easy as a long wheelbase. All right, guys, we're going to get her out for a quick rip, see how she does, and see how these uh, new batteries do from Gen's Ace. These are amazing looking packs. Uh, excited to see how they hold up and how they perform. I'll put a link down below in the description if you guys want to check these out or if you want to purchase some. They're amazing looking packs and I can't wait to see how they perform. All right guys, got the Outcast 8S EXB out. I'm going to try these uh, Creighton EXB tires on it, the uh, Copperhead 2s. I may end up having to put some belted tires on it. We'll see how it goes. Um, on the inside here, I'm still running the uh, Hubby Wing 5687 1100 KV motor, Max 5 ESC. I also installed a carbon fiber tubing in the front right here on this front uh, upper brace just to keep that from bending. And also the M2C uh, brace rod ends right there, the nice 7075 if you guys can see that to uh, keep those from, from uh, snapping. I'm also going to try out the uh, Game Changer fan on this ESC on the Max 5. I'm having a hard time keeping the fan blades intact. Uh, I've even tried uh, different modifications and stuff that I've seen online and stuff like that and it still doesn't work. So I'm going to try this Game Changer fan just to try to keep this ESC cool and see how that holds up. I just uh, strapped it in basically with some zip ties going underneath the plate and then uh, strapped in some uh, screen on the top to try to keep debris out of it. Uh, as far as the diffs, I'm still running the uh, 520 million then the 1 million in the front. I did go down on the gearing from the 3039 that I was running. Went down to a 28 tooth on the pinion with this 1100 kV motor just to try to cut down on the temps because it's really hot right now and humid outside. So uh, the motor was definitely getting hot running that 30 tooth and I had a little bit of bottom end cogging. I'm gonna plug in this game changer fan real quick and you guys can kind of hear what kind of wind this baby's putting off. That should definitely keep the ESC cool as long as the fan blades <laughs> stay intact. Oh yeah, putting out a ton of wind all the way around it too. Yep, it should also help keep the uh, motor connectors a little cooler. All right, let's see what's up. I knew that wouldn't take long. <laughs> yeah, guys, I say we blew that tire to smithereens. I guess we'll put some uh, Duratrax uh, six packs on it. Whoa! Guys, these uh, batteries got plenty of punch, that's for sure. Oh, that was a hard slap.
Just love seeing a big girl fly like that. It's just insane for a 30 pound truck. All right, guys, really digging these packs from Gen's Ace, the Basher packs. Uh, they definitely got plenty of punch. Uh, run time's decent, you know, around your uh, average 15, 20 minutes, just depending on how you're uh, driving. The uh, Game Changer fan uh, kept the ESC cool for sure. It's uh, it's held up so far. So uh, a time will tell, you know, as far as the uh, longevity of these packs. I have to give it several more runs to see how, how good the sales hold up and, and all that. But so far, I'm pretty impressed. Looks like I'm dragging that wing. Was completely blind. I have no idea where that went. Sounded pretty rough. Up, oh, she's still on her feet. Alright guys, got the Zonda. I'm gonna give her a quick little run.